Warning, this video contains the most cringiest moments of my life. I hope you enjoy or waste 10 minutes or sorry of your time. We are about to spill some tea. In today's video, we're going to be reading some of my daughter's diary. This is going to be interesting. is going to be I don't know if it will be juicy or not let's just see I love this design by the way it was given to her by a Christmas present oh this is 2012 I may I will change some names because I just opened this and I know who she's talking about so of course she has a baby picture when she's a baby I'll just take out the names and just read what he says. So this person told me that she was going to get a chemical peel. At the age 13, she's so young to have it done. One of this person's friends asked for how far she has gone with her boyfriend. Uh, honestly, they talk about sex a lot. It's so annoying. Why do they want to rush? I'm 12 years uh, old. <coughs> she's 12 years old saying this. Okay. Why do they want to rush? They have got their whole life still to come. Anyway, I got this book from the library called Prisoner of the Inquisition. It's, wow. <laughs> anyway, uh, Prisoner of the is dude. Okay, so now she just talks about a library being to do back. It's not as interesting as I thought it would be. Uh, okay, now she's talking about prom. Mm -hmm. Prom is only three years away. I already know what I want to wear. Uh, when she dreams, she dreams big. Okay, so she wants a horse drawn and carriage or a limo. I'll be wearing a dress with ruffles and a tiara. Uh, just a quick picture of what she looks like actually at her prom. Yeah. Different from what she got, huh? And she went uh, without a date because it was stressful and no one asked her out. But, <coughs> um, oh, no, it's okay. Wow, this is not as interesting as I thought it would be. What? Oh, okay. My mom keeps calling her shoes mamas. Okay, then I love school every, um, someone, a teacher gives us a lot of homework. My mom is cool and weird. Okay, I, I love Justin Bieber and Jaden Smith. It says it right there. Oh, I'm talking about a crush on a, a guy that I had in school. I don't know if I should say his name. I won't. He knows who he is anyway. There were like three... Out of character, there are like three or four guys that I had a crush on in school. I do, I did not include pictures of them in diary. That would just be sad. Well, this is not going to be as interesting as I thought it would be, but we'll skip to some juicy parts. Basically, is about I love Justin Bieber, because he came out like what, two thousand eleven with one time and then baby and then because I literally I'm writing the lyrics um you smile I smile wow she talks about her friends a lot so far what I see apparently someone might be pregnant I'm back to Justin Bieber again Practicing writing her name. Scribble. No wonder she didn't pass her class as a teacher. Can't understand her handwriting. Oh my gosh. Again, Justin Bieber, and who she may or may not like as a crush. I will bleep out his name by putting an emoji. But here we go. Okay, so. 
<laughs> I'm in love with Jaden Smith and Justin Bieber. I think I might be also be in love with or like Um, he's cute a bit, but I don't think I would go out with him. I'd rather go out with Jaden Smith or Justin. Still waiting. <laughs> no, I'm not. I'm not that desperate. I'm happy for Justin. <laughs> My camera got out because it was bored too. All right, so I'm just going to open up a random page. All right, so... This is... Thursday, 26th July, 2012. I'm just going to read this one and then I'll move on to the next one because Girls Lab is not that interesting. <laughs> anyway, um, I need to improve on my handwriting. I can't really understand my own handwriting repetition. Like, we can't get it already. So it's my handwriting right there. So this is my a new part of high school, year nine. I, Madison, will try to improve on my diary for me and most importantly, my teachers at school <clears throat> try hard <clears throat> my science has decided to move me down to second set my mom was so upset really was she i was she or was she's a pro no stop it i was too i was too my mom keeps on talking about moving me to a private school i'm going to work really hard and prove and prove to her that I want to stay at Friesland with my friends Friesland school was the performing arts school that I went to um, and become intern, <laughs> my dream was to become an international, <laughs> excuse me, her dream was to become an international pop star. How's that working out for you? <laughs> Aww, and she talks about her old high school crush. I mean, wait, hold on, is this Bradley, which Bradley is this? Let's just say Bradley Cooper, because I know which Bradley this is. Oh, this is my childhood crush that I, childhood crush that she had. Um... I'm exposing my I'm exposing her so no one else will have to that's a good mother that I am my dreams are getting weirder by the second let me read, the, read through the stream first because we, this we don't want to get demonetized now I last night my mom and I watched a show called Britain's Strangest Pets it was cute written no this it's not that bad um they're in, an old man who kept exotic pets he treated like royalty I'm pretty sure I remember this. Oh, I'm seeing the part that she rubbed out. That was the juicy stuff, but I honestly don't want to read it. Um, I also watched a movie where a girl faked her own death for money. I'm pretty sure I've seen... You should write down what you saw. And then it's an interesting dream before her and her childhood crush. Who probably doesn't even know she exists. Or <laughs> there's a lot of stuff that's been rubbed out. Let me see if I can make it up. Hold on. Interesting. <laughs> Excuse me while I read my... Uh... It's actually not that bad. It's just describing or kissing him. That's about it. I could be wrong. So detailed. So sad. It's almost like what you would think reading Sheldon from Big Bang Theory Die would be like. I have no idea what it means and only he does. Oh my goodness, she wrote down their life plan. <laughs> Just skip past that. Oh, she talks about, oh. <laughs> She's putting down all the different guys that she thinks is attractive. I will leave out their names, of course, but um, let you tell me the boys' weaknesses and strengths. Well, this is sad. I'm not going to put their names up, but someone has sweaty hands. Someone has nice eyes. Oh, she's so rude. I think she says desperate garbage or grab waste or something i don't know oh yeah that's good she thought tom daly was attractive during the olympics
<sighs> this is not as interesting as I thought it would be. More talk about Jaden Smith. Oh, dear God. Okay. I think I should, like, burn these diaries because... Or just, if anyone wants anything interesting to read, this will definitely put you to sleep. Alright, let's just go to the end and see if there's anything there. Alright, so this is Saturday, November 2012. When I finish the diary, and I think I have a picture of myself in here. I'm not sure of herself in here anyway. <clears throat> so it is now quarter to one in the morning. My mom and I are talking to uncle, my uncle, I mean, my brother. This week, so what just happened on Monday, I went to the Holocaust Center. I learned about who was not the, the Jewish, who was um, treated in Holocaust, but also uh, gay people, black people, gypsies. I was shocked. I listened to the story of a Holocaust survivor. This is interesting. And I actually do have the books here somewhere. And she signed her name. Finally, something worth reading aloud. Okay. Well, you can see how on a good point in this diary, you can see how her handwriting changed from this. Um, her handwriting was known as chicken crap. It's chicken crap. Well, chicken scratch, but you can say the same thing, I guess. To that. Okay, so. Oh dear God, I'm talking about another crush, okay. Um, let me know if you want me to say their names next time. I don't think there will be a next time because honestly, I, I wouldn't want to wish this on anyone. This would be a torture method in some countries. Okay. <clears throat> the Her story was uh, scary, inspiring, and most of all shocking. I bought two books, Children, and I. you saw the books there. I think I might have or developing a crush on this person he's cute and funny actually he's quite smart unfortunately he most important he's not a christian oh okay um and then skipping on that part i'm not looking for a boyfriend yes i may look for another chattered crush i have what i have let things be Work on your English too. Okay. Um, God brought me, God has brought my mom and I this far. I know he has taken, take what? I know he can take me further. God has done so much for my mom and I from the day my legs were hanging out of my mom's womb. Uh, thank you so much for that description. God knew he, he has a plan for me. I am a child of the most high God. Yeah. Well, it got interesting. Uh, when was this? 2012? It got interesting in what? The year in November 2012. Wow. Hey, I thought this would be an interesting video. Kid, you got no life. <laughs> Alright, next. Um, what year is this? 2013. You know what? I'm just going to flick and pick a random page and we're gonna start from there okay Saturday 3rd January 2015 I am not going to bleep it out let's just read what happens and then we'll do the same well guessing by the date that I am safely back from my trip I am 16 finally and I can finally drink coffee um, New York was amazing. I saw Times Square, um, the 9-11 site, and met 
Doyle from Gilmore Girls. And I saw a Nutcracker. We saw a ballet and we went to the circus and we saw the Lion King. It was absolutely awesome. My ultimate Christmas, what? I kept on spending with my family and got an iPhone 6 Plus. I think thanking God here, a big surprise when my papa got an iPad. Um, rest in peace. I'm shopping at Macy's and I got, okay, she got a lot of stuff for Christmas. Um, I'm studying and I have a pain in my lungs. I pray that it goes away. It's gas, sweetheart. Um, Whole Foods is amazing. God's Bears Life tomorrow. I will, what, pick of me when I'm 16? I think she writes this so she doesn't forget when she reads these when she's older. I think this. <laughs> oh, this is in black. Okay, this is February 14th, 2015. This is um, Valentine's Day. So I'm just going to read it as it says. Um, I'm not going to write this in pen for long. Just want to say in permanent ink. You might have seen, oh, okay. You might have seen the blacked out pages. Oh, this is getting juicy. The blacked out pages, well, here it is the truth. They were about sex and they were nasty. It was me, but wasn't. Wow, oh, okay. I made a vow to God and myself that basically we'd have sex until I marry. Trust me, writing about sex and stuff will not stop the urges. I will stop and I sign. Oh my goodness. On oh, Valentine's Day, that is my gift. That is, this is my gift. <laughs> gift to who on Valentine's Day? No more getting cleaned. Bye. <laughs> I signed my name. Here. Just so you can read it. I'm exposing her. So I <laughs> oh. That was probably the best part that I read throughout this whole thing. <laughs> I love it. I'm getting clean. <laughs> okay. <clears throat> All right, let's see what else we have in store. That made my day. Two thousand sixteen. I'm not sure if I actually write about my prom, but I'm sure I will show some pictures. Oh, yeah, Christmas. Uh, Christmas card. Um. One more and then I will put you out of both of our misery. Hey guys, thank you so much for watching this video. I hope you got a kick of it, kick out of it as much as I do. I love exposing my daughter. Um, just a quick side note. Um, I didn't read everything in my diaries because it was surprisingly really boring. Some stuff was exciting to look back on. But um, anyway, I hope you guys have a great rest of your day, the rest of your weekend, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye. Just in case you're wondering, I pulled these photos from my actual um, like photo library from years ago. Interesting to see how many photos of JB I had.